Hi, I'm Sherman Snyder, Mastercam AE from Houston, Texas for MLC CAD Systems. And today I'd like to talk about tool libraries inside of Mastercam. Let's start by going to the Tech Exchange portion of the Mastercam website found just under the Communities tab here at the top. Inside of the Tech Exchange, we'll find a multitude of files that we can download, anything from sample files, posts, mill turn environments, and more specifically tool libraries. We could select the version that we want to use, as well as the units that we want to search for here. And we can add keywords or any kind of product line and run the search option. This search is going to bring up any file that has the inch files readily available. And as we can see here, there's quite a few different companies here we could choose from. I'm going to use the ISCAR Chatter Free library. Now, you may be asking yourself, how do I import these tools? Let's dive off into Mastercam and actually take a look at how this tool library can be imported here. So I'm going to go to the zip file found in my downloads folder here, and we got a tool db file, dot tool db. And I'm going to cut this file. I'm going to place this in the default directory. So we can see here we're in our C drive, users, public, public documents, Mastercam version, machine and tool library. And I'm simply going to paste this file into my library here. We'll start by loading a default machine. So we can see here my tool manager. We're going to go into the tool manager here and we're going to load the library that we just copy pasted into the default directory. This card chatter free. And inside of the tools tab here next to assemblies and holders we can see the tools that were available inside of this current library. We can drag them up top. So we see here, if I go to next, we have the tool name, description, manufacturer name, as well as the EDP number that's saved automatically. So next, you may be asking yourself, can I save a custom library? Well, absolutely. Any of the tools that you see here in my current library for the Machine Group 1 have been brought in from multiple libraries. And I want to save this library that I have right now into a new tool library for later use. I could drag a window over all the tools and simply drag them down to the bottom. As you see here in my Assemblies tab, we now have these tools saved into our directory. I can say yes. So what if you want to access these tools later? We can always go back and open a library from any given library that we saved previously. As we see here, I'm going to open up the, we'll go to the mill inch. This is the default tool directory. And I can load all current tools that are saved within this directory here.